somehow or other, I have ended up in a funky mood today. Like, I don't know if I'm over my long nail era. I don't know that. Welcome back to my channel. Today's video, we are jumping right back into work. Like today is the official day that I start getting back into my work and it's basically making videos all day long. That's basically what I do. Um, I don't have any events today. So yeah, we're just at home today. And today, so many times I'm saying today. It's been very long since I did like a like a bombastic makeup look. If you followed me closely in 2022 or from pandemic, you would know like my eyeshadow looks are like but I've not done them in like a hot minute or a cold minute because it's been very long so I am challenging myself uh, to get back into the whole makeup thing not challenging myself like I want to get back into the whole makeup thing I'm actually just looking for my skincare yeah so here is me preparing my skin to do my makeup it's part of my whole new year's resolution to start doing makeup back and we'll see how that goes so today's look is is a good one is a good one i am excited but at the same time my guys because i've not done um those kinds of look in like a hot minute cold minute i myself i'm thinking like can i really do it like is it possible like can i because sometimes i think with makeup makeup is like a skill basically so the more you do it the more better you get at it i've not done it for some time so i'm just worried if my skills are still there do you get me just moisturizing my dry skin and we'll see how this goes i am excited i am excited I am excited. I will show you the look. Her jacket here. Just putting on another moisturizer. You see that? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. So that is a combination of green, dark blue, black, and glitter. Okay, it's okay. We'll, we'll, we'll just do that. Um, yeah, let's go.
my face looks weird because my eyeliner is still here i find on days now uh, when i do my makeup especially not even on days i do my makeup on days that i apply eyeliner to my bottom lid it just never goes off like no matter how much i wash my face it will never go off like after a few washes only i feel my face will be back to normal but then like technically i can't wash my face too much you know it's very bad also yeah christmas tree is still up i think my usual schedule is i will only take my christmas tree out during chinese new year so expect the christmas tree to be here until chinese new year it is 9 30 i've actually just been on the sofa editing the vlog the pd vlog somehow or rather i have ended up in a funky mood today like i'm i'm feeling funk like my mood is i don't know i don't know like there's no reason for me to feel funky i just you know how i feel guys i feel like holiday is over and i need to work which is so dumb like like for some Someone in my profession it's so dumb because i work from home i'm not reporting to a boss but i feel like that i don't know why it's just like you know finally like everything is over like holiday season and it's settling in like i think i miss my mom as well like i miss having her around i miss chatting i don't know lot today it was just or it's just hormonal you know you know girls go through like four phases in a month like the luteal, methyl, don't know, some teal, teal phases if you've, if you've heard of it. Like one week, like four weeks before, like period and stuff, right? Like one week very happy, one week angry, one week like... I think I'm, I'm in one of those weeks that I'm feeling very meh. Yeah, no reason absolutely, like nothing happened today. It's just, yeah, or it's just starting back work and I don't have the energy. Or, I don't know lah, I've been thinking as I've been editing the PD vlog, I think the holiday has left me a bit weird, which is funny, which is very funny, okay. My character, I don't know if this makes sense, huh? it sounds very philosophical, but just hear me out. I absorb energy, like example, if someone's angry, if I talk to them, I will feel angry as well. Or if someone's sad and depressed, Press. like that emotion can rub off of me and somehow or other the pd room did not give me a good vibe i don't know why i think it was a lighting like lighting has a huge thing huge huge part in my life and i think like i love yellow lights i love yellow lights but that place was just too dingy i wouldn't say creepy like it's not it's not giving me creepy vibes but i just feel because it was not clean like i was telling you right because i just edited the vlog i was listening to the last part like because the bathroom was not clean like example middle of the night i had woken up i needed to go to the toilet but i didn't go like i held it like i just tahan myself until morning because like i was worried like there'll be insects or like you know something like i'm very big on smells that's one thing like if i smell something funky like i cannot i cannot like yeah so i held it in and i was like scared to like walk everywhere i did not put my skincare out of the box because i was worried like ants will crawl into it because there were ants in the bathroom and even when i was like washing my face i think i yeah this is all like first world stuff so i think because of that it did not actually give me like a very happy happy vibe do you get me so that's why that's why even in the video there's not many clips in the room because we did nothing like we were just sitting on the aircon i don't know lah. it's just no i'm not gonna complain but yeah first world stuff so that's i think that could also be it or it could just be the whole idea actually nothing no i cannot there's no explanation to this so i am going to try and get myself out of this funk so one of the deals for this year that ivan and i have done is no meals after 7 30 so which is good today we did it ivan was ordering nasi kanda in the evening and he was raving about this nasi kanda and i said okay i will try so i asked like for half rice uh the chicken and then i thought like okay i'll eat around 6 30. ate it it was bad I don't know maybe it was my packet maybe the packet was just there for some time the vegetable had spoiled so half of the rice like i already took half rice so half of the rice uh had the vegetable smell whatever anyways yeah so food was like uh but you know the whole rye the tuna on rye was so nice that was so nice after eating it my stomach felt like yeah discovering because i used to eat rye thins very long time ago and then yesterday uh yesterday when we came back from pd we actually stopped in the grocery uh shop for a while like i ran up to go and buy some stuff then i saw this and i'm like oh like i can eat this as well so oh that was so nice so picking myself out of this we gotta do something we cannot sit here yeah i'm gonna go and make myself a tea also stuff that i'm watching on netflix now i have stumbled upon 
uh, the whole Harlan Coburn universe if you if you know what I mean uh, so Fool Me Once came out um, last week I think so Harlan Coburn is actually a writer he writes books if I'm not mistaken and some of his books have got adapted into series so one of the series that came out last week was Fool Me Once and his type of genre is like you know like crime a bit of thriller like mostly crime like investigative stuff and I love stuff like that so I watched Fool Me Once last week it was amazing and then I realized like Netflix actually has like five to six of his series like adapted from his books and yeah today I started one more it's called safe uh, going so well but I'm not gonna watch it now because already my mood is like Ugh. we're not gonna watch another investigative story and feel some more I really I'm really sorry guys like beginning of the year things are a bit slow I don't know how you're feeling tell me how you're feeling beginning of the year I know usually everybody is very preppy and peppy and very like ah excited i want to be excited but i don't know why i feel like this but we can change it so yeah okay so i figured let me just get out of this let me watch like my favorite show put me back into a really good mood while sorry while doing that uh, morning i wrote down all my tasks i am going to like cancel it off and plan for tomorrow like what i have I actually feel much more better you know why I had some laundry to do in the room so I came in and then I thought to myself okay I need to go and sleep so I told myself you know what let me just do the laundry like let me just settle this because my water heater needs like some time to like become hot like at least like 10 minutes so I did my laundry like I hung up stuff not everything guys not everything there is still I would say 40% left in the basket but I did it I did 60% and I feel so good ah, this lotion it's the Chanel number no. 5 one. Oh my gosh. Today was a whirlwind of emotions and I'm so sorry if there's nothing much happening in this vlog. But usually, even if I'm feeling very peppy, this is my normal routine on a daily basis. Like, we don't do much. Like, Ivan's working. Ivan's in his room. He's on TikTok. <laughs> TikTok live, actually. So cute. And yeah, workdays are basically like this. So let me get in, tuck myself in. We'll answer some questions because I don't think I've answered some questions in a hot minute. Also, my pyjamas. It's Christmas theme because I did not use it during vlogmas I don't know why it was like shoved into my drawer like at the back of the drawer and I realized that oh my god I got this to wear during vlogmas but I didn't but it's okay something was bound to like give way during vlogmas it was the pajamas it's fine da. also we need to set up my kindle I'll explain I'll explain I know you're like why are you setting up a kindle again one of life's greatest joy is to get into bed one of life's greatest greatest joy okay i like this question i'm gonna answer some questions that i got on the previous vlogs as well that i've missed out anita says she loves the beach but terrified of insects yes my friend like i think that was one of the reasons why i did not enjoy the whole experience because i was scared to like step out on my own like usually example remember okay let's say golden sands in penang it's not very tree-ish if ivan is still sleeping i'll get up i will walk down to the pool area when you wake up early on holiday the vibe is different like that's the time i like to maybe pray uh read my bible listen to my worship song it's that quiet time and i remember when i woke up in pd i was thinking like oh my god how am i gonna go by myself there's so much of trees to walk through so not ideal for me i know a lot of other people love it but insects and me we're not friends they think we are friends i assure you we're not friends okay have you done a room tour of my workspace i've not done a tour but i've like shown you the room but i'll do a tour i'll show you like where i keep everything like yeah and the list of foundations and like concealer shades that's actually a very good one i will i will do that i will definitely do that and charmila says i've gone crazy over the killian perfume but pure thought of buying that much I know I know but at the same time I know if I didn't buy the Chanel perfume I could have at least kept 
that money to buy my Kylian perfume. I don't know, look, guys, I don't know. At this point, I'm like, oh, I don't know. I love it that you guys are enjoying it. Trust me, guys, every time I post the YouTube video, I'm constantly refreshing to check out your comments, and I love, love, love hearing from you. Happy New Year to everybody who has who has left a comment. I love you guys. And even Happy New Year to everybody who's watching. Um. Okay, so Yulin asked, any plans to go visit mom in Australia? Um, yes. I like to go during winter because the weather is just autumn winter so we'll see we'll see if we can make that work Anusha Mercy says talk about your lifestyle of having nail extensions because you're curious because you're struggling having nails extended okay honestly it's not hard having long nails it's not hard it's just I got to do everything a bit more slower example if I'm putting jeans on I got to do it slowly because if I pull it up normal I will poke myself uh, there's a lot of stuff actually almost everything I can do by myself maybe picking coin up from actually picking coin up from the floor also can I just got to do it a bit more slower so every you just slow down a bit when you have nails but the truth guys oh my god I don't know if my nail tech is watching this but you know the truth is I don't know if I'm over my long nail era I don't know that I don't know if I want to go back to short nails I don't know if I'm over this I just don't know how I feel because I'm thinking like you know the, sh the short square white nails gives you like the clean girl aesthetic so i don't know we'll see and also like this design is gorgeous it's beautiful but i want to show you something Wait, uh, okay can you see how the stones it's basically rough you know so what is happening is this is getting caught in a lot of stuff like towels, clothing, curtain, bed sheet, everything is getting caught in it and I don't like that so it's either I will keep the long nails but I will, will reduce my stone work because of like I'm a regular person at home you've seen that like I don't have a maid I don't have anybody like cleaning up after me um, it's just Ivan and I always doing everything so I don't like it getting caught in stuff like I don't want to ruin clothes like remember the Nike sweater that we bought from GPO I've not used it because it's a sweater it's wool and this will definitely 100% like nick it and like pull it pull the string out so yeah so I personally I do not know if I'm over it I still love my long nails maybe I'll take a break I don't know we'll see when nail day comes can I know where you got your Bible the, the contents look colorful and attractive I got the Bible actually from Shopee I will try to link the Shopee link down if it's still available if not I found it on Amazon I basically got it from glad sound so if you're Christian <laughs> you would know that last time we all used to get our like praise and worship CDs um, anything Christian based from this shop called Glad Sounds, it's in PJ. Glad Sounds actually has a Shopee account and I found the Bible on the Glad Sounds account. I like your journal, can you suggest a journal? Um, the journal that I have now, the planner slash journal, is from Hustle Sainly, it's from America. So you have to like order it via um, their website and then it'll reach you in like two to three weeks. I like this. Sharmila says, It's great to see a Malaysian Indian YouTuber rising and made a great platform. Oh my god. You have no idea. Sometimes on days that I'm feeling down, I'll actually go through your old comments. And I'll read it and I'll remind myself like, you know what? <laughs> I'm loved by so many of you. Um, I think that's about it for the q and A. I I need to set up my Kindle. So what I learned from my Kindle is place I even bought my Kindle was from Kindle Malaysia in Shah Alam. Account that they opened the Kindle for me with is actually a shared account. So there's other people also using it because Malaysia doesn't have Kindle and it's this whole process. So I was telling them that I need a personal account because I want to buy the books. So that's the thing I didn't know about Kindle. I didn't know that you have to purchase the books to read it. Like Kindle Unlimited will only give you a certain number of books and not the others. And um, the one that I want, want to read so badly is Ekota, A Court of Thorns and Roses. So I told them that I needed my own personal account that I bought the, the gift card to use to purchase my books and I finally got my account set up. I need to log in with that and then I can purchase my books and we can start reading Ekotar. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. So, okay guys, thank you so much for watching me into here. I'm sorry if this video didn't have like much going on. I can't fake it. I still need to post. I'm not gonna skip a day unless like I really ha have to or I want to. But for now, I'm good. But so, I love you guys so much. I hope you're doing good. Please ask me more questions uh, down below. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye! I love you. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe. Okay, bye.